Hi, guys. If you have a PCB project ready to start, I would like to give you some advice. If you have an order of $1 million and it is very high quality, you can directly look for a supplier that has a top hat, which is in the form of top hat. I suggest this because these bigger suppliers put more energy on large customers, have more experience in dealing with large order buyers, and have stable quality. This save buyer's time and effort. If you don't have such a large order and pay attention to the price, you can look for multiple suppliers to compare establishment time and evaluation, certificate, production experience, and after sales. The quantity can also be very good. But please be careful to choose the right supplier. Among the customers we have received before, many customers say they have been cheated, so they have very cautious when placing an order in our store. How are they deceived? After the customer placing the order, the supplier said they could not fulfill the requirements before the order, wasting the customer time and energy, and even unable refund due to the time reasons. So, how to choose a suitable supplier? First, send your request. The production capacity of each supplier is different, and some supplier cannot meet your requirements such as process and component compatibility. At this point, the right supplier will give you feedback on their offer. Next, confirm whether the supplier has a parts you need and how the delivery is. Our factory will confirm whether there are required components before quantity and its available time will roughly calculate the delivery time after confirmation. The general lead time from our factory is about 25 days notice. In this step, the buyer must ask the supplier to take, take stock photos of warehouse components or confirm that the component supplier has stock. Finally, ask the PCB buyers to understand the fact that the price and inventory of components vary greatly and the situation of the components may be different from day to day. So even if you place an order as long as no components and are purchased, it cannot guarantee your delivery time will be longer. So the above mentioned customer was cheated and the supplier may not mean it. So why do I still recommend it to confirm whether the components are in stock? Because the securement channel sources of different suppliers are different. If a supplier has out of stock components, it also means that it has more per securement channels and has more anti-risk Thanks for your watching. Please follow me for more videos. Bye.